Hello, my name is Mark Peters, a veteran actor. <laughs> Peters. Mark Peters. <laughs> Hi. You're looking healthy, sweetheart. What? Just healthy what, sounds what did like... I say? Have you eaten anything, Jade? The chicken is delicious. I ate the heart. At least she ate something. I'm just trying to figure my... You're too fucking old for this. You're disrupting the peace in this household. Peace? Jesus, Dad, do you want me to tell Mom where we saw each other? Hold it. This is it. I'm gonna cross first. If something goes wrong, hide in these woods until dark. Then make your way back carefully to where we started from. It's a sign. A fear sometimes. You don't have a real relationship with God. Hey, I got a surprise for you. It's a girl's back. It's pink. So paint it blue. But Dad, boys' backs have different seats. It's not anatomically correct. God spoke to me. He did? Ezekiel. Did he really? Okay. Don't think I've forgotten about last night. You can tell Bill and that bitch wife Mary of his that they can forget about ever coming over here again. I'm always a bad guy! You must be fucking postal, the bang of my door. Look, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. What the hell are you talking about? I don't see anything. Where am I? Hey, where are you taking me? Let me go! You let me go. I swear I'll never lay a hand on my wife and daughter again. Don't, don't do this. Uh, look, there, there's got to be something you still want to, want to do or, or see in the world. Hey, hey, uh, have you ever been, have you ever been to Europe? You haven't lived until you've seen Paris. My life sucks too. Everybody's does. We have Mr. Mark Peters here. Actor who has been, ay, 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 you've been working. In the last two, three years, I've made about two dozen films. One of the films, called Optimistic, has been accepted to a number of festivals. Well, how about your mother? How's she holding up? You'd think after a while she would get a new boyfriend or something. Well, it's hard, Cameron. Your father was a good man. Well, has it had an effect on you? Uh, your mom, I mean. Can we change the subject? I, I don't want to get into this. Well, it's up to you. What do you want to talk about? Can I ask you a question, Doc? Yeah, sure. When was the last time you got laid? <laughs> well, it's kind of a personal question, Cameron. Why do you ask? I'll see you Thursday around 8, then. Hey, Doc. Hey, Cameron. Well, what are you doing here so early? What do you mean? We had an appointment for 8 o'clock. Don't you remember last week? No, no, you were scheduled for 9. I have something for you. I wanted to show you. Well, I don't think it looks anything like me. Look at the eyes. Why aren't you wearing your hair? It itches me. Hello, Annabelle. 
You're so young. Beautiful eyes. I'll be the last to see them. Does it still hurt? No. Are you cold? No. Peter? Yes, Annabelle. she died I think she was strangled I have something for you tilt your head to the side lift lift your arm bend it slightly You know I don't like your hair this length. You made me so beautiful, Peter. I knew you'd be perfect for that dress. <sighs> she won't need it. No. I am stuck at the office again, and I'm going to be here for another couple of hours at least, so I won't be home for Din Din tonight. If you could uh, just leave a plate for me, and I'll zap it in the microwave later on. That would be great. See you soon. Bye-bye. You okay? You bothering her? I have a daughter about your age. Where am I dropping you off? 242 Evergreen Way. 242? 242. 242. What are you still doing here? Ann? God, you even stand like your mother. How is she? She know you're here? A chamomile or a... told me where you were. I want to talk. Are you in trouble? I made a mistake, Nadia. How many months? Does it matter? Who's the father? He's gone. 